Nice. Fuck, what's up, done. Fuck. What up, guys? What up, guys? Do a real quick short video on um, sobriety. Day 9 slash day 10. Okay, I didn't make a video yesterday, so this video is gonna be for yesterday and today. So first, let's talk about day 9. Basically, day 9 is very brief. Like, I didn't get high on day 9, I didn't smoke any crack or, or anything, I didn't do any drugs on day 9. I just pretty much slept the whole day just watch videos. Mainly on actualite.org and uh, I called Thief and I think a couple other people. I would just watch the spiritual videos for the most part and shit, and just getting a better idea of non duality and whatnot, what it is. And here's one thing I, I, I saw in the video that was really, really interesting now. Code Theo said this. If you, if you take away anything from any of my videos, take away this. If you're, if you're interested in God's more enlightenment or spirituality or God realization, it's this. Here's the truth, guys, about, about the truth of no self. Basically, the thing about no self is this. There actually is no illusion. There actually is no self already and there is no illusion. So therefore, there's no illusion to transcend or anything. You already are God. You already have no self. You already are unconditional love um, alive and being and living. That's what you are. You are love incarnate. You are love being itself. That's what you are. You're not a human. You're not an organism. You're not a mammal or anything. You are love manifested in being itself. You are a unique, one of a kind expression of God's love, unconditional love. That's what you actually are. So never forget that. Never remember that you are God, aka you are love. I mean, I can say you are God, but the most accurate way of saying that you are love. You are love incarnate and being. You are love being itself right now. You are being in love itself and you are experiencing love itself. So never forget that, guys. That's a real advanced God's right there. I got that from Coach Theo. Anyways, yeah, so now day 10. So day 10, so day 9 was sober, but day 10, I just bought some practice now, I just took a hit just now, and I'm pretty high right now. So it's like, yeah, so day 10, I'm using it, but after today, well, I'd say I'm not gonna smoke until. What's going on? Let's go with this shit. Okay. So yeah, pretty much after tomorrow, after today, I'm not gonna smoke until I get my high. And then after I get my high, then I'll find the I, I mean, even though I still I still rep by sexuality, cause I do like trans women and trans girls and Chinese and and trans trans females and stuff. You know, I prefer females to males more, cause I used to a guy without a pussy, but I have no problem with male to female. I just want to touch their dick at all. I just have to fuck their mouth and fuck their ass. I ain't never the point. So yeah, daytime. Daytime. I know getting high. I just got high just now for the first time today. Right now it's 8:30 in the morning. I'm almost done with my first dime. So yeah, so today I got high, but today I'm not gonna get high again until I get my cash. And after I get my cash and I have fun, I get some hats from loose from my mistress or whatever. After that day, I'm not gonna do crack at all for at least like over a month or two, at least. Like for the month of May, I know a lot of that. For the whole month of May, I'm not gonna do crack. But I'm thinking of doing crack in, 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 in June 1st. That's my halfway birthday mark. That's my halfway birthday, June 1st. And then I'm gonna do summer 1st in my birthday. So that's what I'm saying. So now I'm only gonna smoke crack like twice a year or once a year. That's what I'm gonna do it. But after all, uh, when I get my money, I buy some crack or whatever, and I chill with my mistress or whatever. After that, I'm not gonna do crack until I get my cash. I didn't get my cash next week, I only one. But after that, though, um, 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 fucking um, yeah, I'm gonna do crack for a while. So. Maybe I'm gonna do a June first. I'm gonna just try to take it from the end of the year. So yeah, I'll take time, guys. I got high, guys. And after this, I'm gonna take a probably, I mean, I don't know when my, my cash comes in yet, I'm gonna check tomorrow, but it might come in here Tuesday or Monday. So yeah, we gotta see, guys. But hopefully everything goes good, and I can smoke that day, get some head, and after that, I won't have to smoke at all again. I woke up, when I, went, when I went to sleep and woke up today, I had no desire to smoke crack. It was just that the simple fact that I had some money that my mom had left me, so I was able to buy it for easily. I just had to make two hundred dollars. So that's pretty much the reason why I smoked today. And also because I have to pay somebody back. And when I owe me on money and stuff, where I make money, I usually have to smoke so that I could be more motivated to go back out and make more money again. Cause if I buy weed, I'm gonna go out once and then I'm not gonna go out again for the whole day. But anyways, yeah, I got it.